I wanted to share with you as I work on my Briggs and Stratton 5 horsepower engine some of the tools that I've been using in addition to a toolbox full of uh, screwdrivers, ratchets, sockets, and wrenches. I also have some specialty tools from Briggs and Stratton and other places. Here we have a Briggs and Stratton starter clutch tool for removing the starter. Uh, this is the flywheel holder. Uh, that is in use in conjunction with this piece to hold the flywheel in place while you turn the starter off. Uh, this here is a uh, valve spring tool. It takes the pressure off the spring so you can remove the valves. This is another flywheel remover. Um, this one I had did not have to use for this particular engine, but I'm sure that will come in handy. And this is my lapping tool. Although this is a little bit more advanced than the stick with the two suction cups on the end, I actually haven't used that yet. Looking forward to using that. And uh, if it doesn't work well, I'm going to go back to a stick with two suction cups. Also, when I put the piston back in place, I've got my piston ring compression here. And uh, this is actually from Sears, I believe. I got it from Craftsman some time ago. So those are some of the tools that I'm going to be using to put this engine back together and some of the tools I use to take it apart. All right. See you again.